Well, it's 5.45 in the morning. I'm at my apartment and I'm locking the truck. Get ready to head in. Oh, it's dark. There we go. Gotta be there in a half an hour. So, came down the truck this early to make sure that we sitting there on time. Then I gotta switch trucks with Doug, because apparently Doug won't drive the other truck. And Ben doesn't want him to because some things going on with it. He's concerned that if anyone else drives it other than me, I wonder if the person driving it screwed it up. So I get to be an old dirty dumb truck. Kind of the downside to being reliable. And so we need to do probably about 10 more loads, I think. So five loads each. So hoping it'll take us about four hours or so, which won't be too bad of a day. <sighs> I'm actually not too tired, to be honest with you. So, let's see how this day starts to develop. Is any good? I was just uh, was editing that sunset drone shot. Came out not too bad, but my uh, computer wouldn't render the damn thing. So I come preview it. But hopefully it came out good. But I put the drone up for 45 minutes and then just pointed at the sunset and tried to get the uh, like a hyperlapse of it. Sped it up 500%. And when I get home tonight, maybe it'll look good. But I got got up an hour and a half ago just to try and edit, get it, try and post it. But uh, computer's being slow, so. Maybe later on we'll get it posted. <sighs> All right, heading to the plant. Well, it's 9.15, I'm on my second load. I'm in the red one now, the old dumb truck. Headed back over to the plant. Might have been done pretty early today. And I know I won't be able to leave, go home, go fishing early. I gotta do, change a couple lights on the new dumb truck. off early and I can run home and get the tackle box and the bait and the two big poles and go see if I can hook onto a river monster or not. Probably won't, but hey, you know, if you don't go fishing, you won't catch anything. So, kind of see what happens. But, here's hoping. If I don't end up working tomorrow, I'm planning on staying up all night and go fishing tonight, but every time I think I'm going to do some, all the plans I'm changing. So I can hope and wish for something all I want and I'll end up changing. I'm right over by Walmart right now. They're putting in a, a, a car wash right here, which is what Russell really needs, a car drive through car wash. We don't need anything else to do. I have someone more, somewhere for the young kids to go, but sure as hell need a car wash. Well, sitting over here at Walmart, Ben to call me and let me know to go get another load. They wanted a little bit of time to go spread that rock first before me and Doug put on two, two more loads and overwhelm them. So I went inside, looked for more fishing stuff, grabbed a couple things. I need a fillet knife, but I figured I probably shouldn't go get a fillet knife before going into the plant. Uh, I might just look a little weird. And there's plenty of them, but there's a pair of fishing pliers is the one on the left, so I went and snagged those real quick. Now I'm waiting, hanging out. Hopefully they'll uh, they'll get that spread and call me here pretty soon. But Walmart's pretty busy for being, oh, what time is it now? 11.20, middle of the day on Friday. Pretty damn busy in there. But this is like the number one busy spot in the whole town. So, sit and wait. Waiting for a phone call. And then maybe go fishing. Hopefully. 
Well, I got the little hooks that go on your hat, too. So, I, I had mine taken away from me a long time ago, so I decided to go buy a new one. So, finally. Yeah, nothing yet. <sighs> it's gonna be a long day counting down the minutes before I can go fishing. It's Friday and it's payday. Well, plans got changed. Not following California rig north of Dover. Now I'm headed south down to Centerville. I'm in uh, Darnell right now. Headed out to that shale pit in Centerville. And then I guess we're making a bunch of rounds going down to uh, a levee project or something like that. Rick kind of told me about it, but I didn't quite understand. I, I don't know where anything's at here. And, you know, he's like, you turn over here, you go down there, and you know, just moved here not even a year ago. So I don't know where any of these places are at. But Doug should be on his way down there. He lives that direction. So I know he kind of knows the area better than me. And then I'll uh, follow him around for one round, and then I'll kind of know where to go. They're fishing instead of in the dump truck, but hey, it is what it is. So we'll see how this goes. Well, this load's taking me way out in the middle of nowhere. And this must have been an old river or something because it is flat. Mountains on all sides, and this is flatter and flat. Maybe an old lake or something like that. But they said to go to the end of the road see it kind of twist around and all that and then dump because they can't miss it so we'll see how hard it is to miss beautiful area i'm sure the camera doesn't do it justice but man if the river runs through here we might go out come out here and go fishing but i don't think this is uh, uh this river that's here is very deep Well, I'm out fishing about 10 o'clock. Tape the glow sticks to the tops of the poles. And we're right at the bottom of the lock, right where the wall ends. Way off over there is a little blinking light, and that's Jared walking over here with his buddies. So he got nothing better to do. The light's behind me, so you can't see me that great, but a couple little nibbles, see how it goes. Well, it's one o'clock in the morning. Glow stick's still going. We are uh, headed upstairs. We end up fishing till oh, 10.30 or 11, I think it was. And then we met someone that is from my hometown. So we end up sitting there talking with him all the way up until not too long ago. And we stopped at McDonald's, got something to eat real quick. Now I'm grabbing the stuff off the truck here. Take it upstairs. Ashley's about to let the dogs out to go pee. We're gonna go to bed, I'm pretty damn tired. Tomorrow I'm gonna move the D6. No, sorry, I'm gonna move the D3. And then we're gonna get everything prepped to go fishing before sunrise on Sunday. And we're probably not gonna go fishing tomorrow. And then we're gonna fish most of the day on Sunday, I think. I figure that'd be better. Morning bite's always a better bite. So we'll end up just doing that, taking kind of a break from fishing tomorrow, more than likely, unless we go like search for a spot or something like that, which isn't too big of a deal. But glow sticks worked great she's uh she's got the dogs out right now to go pee so it's time for bed we'll see you guys tomorrow